Hi, and welcome to our first video in May for our intermediate level workouts or our activities of daily living. So a couple of things to go over, make sure that you go back and do your mobility warm up for May or whichever one doesn't really matter, but we try to keep them in the month. So do your, do your mobilities, come back. Um, your reps are gonna be eight, 10 and 12 for the first part, okay? And you don't need a lot of equipment. You need something to sit to stand on, you need a couple of dumbbells and a kettlebell if you have it. If you don't have a kettlebell, you can use one of your dumbbells, no problemo. And then we're gonna have our bands. So we want our lighter band for our French press, a heavier band for our seated rowing. If you have the angles 90 handles, fantastic. If you don't, a towel will do nicely. And then you want a mini band um, for some bridges. Other than that, pretty simple. This is like, again, one of those workouts that you could just take a little bit of equipment or use a gym at a hotel, do it, do it wherever, super easy, okay? So to get started, we're gonna do our dumbbell sit to stand retraction curl, all right? This is a new one. So you're gonna take your dumbbells, compress them together, do your sit as you stand, you're gonna up and curl, sit, up and curl, okay? So notice I didn't just do a regular bicep curl, I did a, I don't know, retraction curl. So my shoulders kind of go up and back. They don't shrug up, they don't do a circle, but they do, I don't know, as I curl, okay? So again, compress the weights, sit as you stand, retraction curl. All right, so we're gonna knock out eight of those. And you're gonna grab your kettlebell if you have it, if not, grab your weight and you're gonna do a forward lunge, okay? So I'm gonna hold the weight in my right hand and I'm gonna step with my left. So I'm gonna step forward, okay? And then I'm gonna push off with my heel to pop back, okay? So down into my lunge, pop back, okay? The key to these is not stepping so far forward that you have to take multiple tries to get back. So what I mean by that, don't step out here and then have to work hard to get back. Just take one smooth lunge, pop it back, okay? Eight on each side of those. Then go back to your sit to stands for 10, your lunges for 10, 12 sit to stands, 12 lunges, done with the strength part of the workout. Then we get into a little bit higher intensity. So we're gonna go a little bit lighter weights, more reps, get that heart rate up, and we're gonna do this for up to four rounds, okay? So we're gonna start with our lighter weights. Depending on where you are, threes, fives, seven and a halfs at the most. So we're gonna do our shoulder triangle. So we have 10 front raises, okay? Then we have 10 lateral raises, and then we're gonna hinge forward, all right? And then do 10 posterior ones or reverse flies, okay? So 10, 10, and 10, 30 total. Then we have our band French press. So we're gonna grab, you know, if you wanna use the more heavier band, go right ahead. I just like to demo with the orange band. So you're gonna step out, okay? My elbows are in, they're glued on a tabletop. The band is here at my forehead. And I'm gonna straighten my arms and bend, straighten, and bend, okay, for 15 of those. All right, then we're gonna grab your chair or grab your bench, whatever you need to sit on, and we have 20 seated rows, okay? And we want our hands in a neutral grip, so what I mean by that is my palms face each other, okay? Shoulders are back and down, pull in and squeeze, keep those shoulders back and retracted, don't let them go forward with the band. So. We have 20 of those. Then the last move is we're gonna do a, um, a bridge with the mini band above your knees and a weight on your hips to add a little extra resistance. So band comes on here over the thighs. I'm gonna grab a dumbbell. I'm gonna lay it on my hips, press it in to the tops of my thighs so it's not sitting directly on my hip bones. My heels are up, her heels are down, my toes are up, and lift up and squeeze. So now you're trying to press this weight up to the ceiling. So it just adds another level of difficulty, gives you a little bit more resistance, makes you work a little bit harder. So those are the four exercises, and we wanna to try to get through all four of those up to four times. So that is the end of the workout. 
Hope you guys enjoyed it, and we look forward to seeing you back here again soon for more awesome workouts.